Today, we're spilling all the beans on the 90 Day Fiancé Pillow Talk series. You know, the show where we get to watch past 90 Day stars, watch the current stars. It's like reality TV inception, right? But not all duos are created equal, and some, let's just say, they make us question the casting choices big time. For starters, Pillow Talk hit our screens back in 2019, and while it's been a ride, some duos, well, they're the kind you'd leave off your invite list. Picture this, the show's over, and then boom, we're on someone's couch or bed, watching them watch the show. It's supposed to be this casual, witty banter fest, but sometimes it's more like watching paint dry. But with commentary, take Kimberly and Jamal Menzies. Kim's been around the 90 day block, but on Pillow Talk, it's like a cringe comedy hour with her son. They've got a couch in their kitchen, because why not? And Kim's trying so hard to be funny that it's not. Like, remember the time Jamal handed her cat food instead of tuna? Hilarious, but also, what? Now Dean Hashim and Rigan Bado, Dean's loud, Rigan's quiet, and the vibe's just off. It's like watching a one-man show with a silent partner. Then there's Lauren and Alexei Bravarnik, who just won't leave the pillow talk couch. Great folks, but it's like that guest who overstays their welcome. Jenny Slatten and Sumit Singh are like vanilla ice cream, Nice, but not exactly thrilling. And let's not forget the Gibbs parents. Ron in his tiny shorts, and Betty with her snails and wine. It's a tipsy critique session that nobody asked for. Bilal Haziez and Shaida Sween, the king and queen of monotony, landed on pillow talk and brought all the yawns with them. And Big Ed Brown with his mom Norma. It's a mix of face palms and sighs, as Ed does his thing, and Norma, well, she's there. But the crown for the most, what were they thinking? Duo goes to Stephanie Matto and her mom Magda Ballaro. Stephanie's trying to be the edgy queen, but it's more like the Duchess of Discomfort. So, there you have it folks. From the funny to the forced, Pillow Talk has seen it all. But what do you think? Who would you cast on the ultimate Pillow Talk couch? Drop your dream duos down below, let's make our own casting list. Before you go, hit that like if you enjoyed our chat, subscribe for more hot goss, and ring that bell so you don't miss out on any updates. Until next time, this has been Max signing off. Keep the convo alive, and I'll catch you all on the flip side. Peace out.